curtains, plumber, and uh, yeah, radio. Radio. <laughs> okay, good. So uh, let's uh, bring him on in and we'll uh, sing the little uh, melody. Is it cold? Yeah, welcome hey, to hey, 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 In my line of work, I need to look good. Whether I'm going to, I don't know, uh, a club or a club, <laughs> or the restaurant supply warehouse. <laughs> I'd like to have nice looking arm candy. Bachelorette number one, how would you make me look good at the club? Oh, honey. <laughs> I'm at the club all the time. Seven years ago. <laughs> and there's just no contest. There is no contest. Ah, okay. Bachelorette number two. How would you look like make, make me look good at a family gathering, say a funeral? Probably a light blue shirt. And... Maybe some jeans that didn't fit quite right. <laughs> <laughs> People see too much. Oh. Yeah. That sounds charming. <laughs> <laughs> Bachelorette number three. Say, I was going to the club. How would you make me look good? Oh, I love the club. Because there's no windows in there. So you'll just look fantastic under the black lights. Oh, black lights. I hope that's making a comeback. <laughs> okay. Bachelorette number one. Yes. Oops, it's... I talked early. That's okay. <laughs> but don't do it again. <laughs> it's important to me to have a girlfriend who knows when to keep her mouth shut. What's the biggest secret you ever kept? <laughs> Well, if I told you, then it wouldn't be a secret, but I'm going to go ahead and tell you I did a bunch of coke in 2007. Cool. Oh, I mean, my biggest secret <laughs> is that now I'm stronger enough to let you go. Ah, ah, okay, okay, thank you very much. Bachelorette number two, what's the biggest secret you've ever kept? Probably about the Johnson house. <laughs> oh, you care to elaborate or are you lawyered up? My company doesn't really want me to say much, but let's just say I didn't put so much time. Oh, say no more. Right. I know about the home contracting business. <laughs> Bachelorette number three, what's your biggest secret? Well, nobody really ever notices, or if they do, they're too kind to say it, but all the windows in my house are actually paintings, so that when I'm ready for it to be dark, I can just turn off the lights rather than, like, deal with anything else. <laughs> oh, like solitary. Okay. <laughs> got one they're, more. they're really nice paintings, though. I've got one more round of questions. Bachelorette number one. I may need to hide out. I don't know. <laughs> I mean, I'm sorry. I may need. Oops, oops again. That's okay. That's two on. But that's two on you. I may need to hide out for a couple of weeks until things quiet down. Where would you hide me? <gasps> I hide out for a couple of weeks sometimes too. Huh. How about we hide out in Las Vegas and maybe like stay up real late, head down to this little white building. Walk in, sign a couple things. Oh, oops. That sounds that sounds appealing. <laughs> okay. Uh, bachelorette number two. Where would you hide me? Mm, probably in the Smith's basement. They don't ever go down there. It's... Oh, I've hidden things in the basement myself. <laughs> yeah, you know they, they don't really. 
really like go down there much. And yeah, there's a nice place behind like all of their water mains. Oh, that sounds very appealing. Ben, thank you. Bachelorette number three, where would you hide me for oh, a couple of weeks? Oh, my house is a fantastic hiding place. Do you know why? Why is that? Because you can't see in, and nobody can see you, and there's nothing to, like, peek around or, like, push off to the side or collect dust or light on fire or anything. Oh, okay. <laughs> that, sounds, that sounds very safe. Yeah. I've, I've had some experience in a safe house. <laughs> right. So have you made your decision on uh, who's a luckily bachelorette? Uh, yes, I think I, I think I've arrived at a decision. And, and which one uh, is not going to be going on the date with you? But bachelorette number one is not. Uh, I don't think we would be compatible because um, I couldn't quite remember which '90s singing star uh, she was. You know. The blonde. The, oops, I did it again, gal. Oh, yeah. Nice berries. But I couldn't remember her name. Yeah. Audience, what's the name? Britney Spears. That's right, Britney Spears. Yeah, right. Uh, sorry, oh, Britney. I'm sorry, Britney. That's okay, I can tell you're a womanizer. <laughs> <laughs> and I don't think I'm interested in bachelorette number three. What? Why is that? Well, the... Well, I think it would be a great place to hide out and uh, everything. I, I do like to get out and get some fresh air. And someone who's agoraphobic is not uh, quite to my liking. Someone oh, who's afraid of... I don't like going outside. It's just... The lights. You're afraid of the lights. The lights are okay. It's just... <laughs> the things by the windows, they just collect oh. so much dust and oh, so yeah. flammable. Yeah, I understand. I get a little jumpy when someone says, it's curtains for you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so I'm sorry. But so, I would like, I would like to ask out Bachelorette number two. Why is that? Because an interior decorator. <laughs> oh, that go deeper than that. <laughs> an esthetician? No. <laughs> Right under your sink. Oh, that's right. I forgot about the cr that crack you had about the. <laughs> <laughs> that's right. A good plumber. Yeah. Yes, Josephine. 